All right, I wanted to give a quick update to the lossless scaling video that I made a couple days ago. Um, I found a better way to show you guys uh, the frame gen situation. Because uh, in the last video, I didn't really go into detail on how to get it working fully and like what it looks like. Kind of just skipped over it a little bit. So I am playing Armor Reforger. Uh, we're just playing on one of, one of the servers that I play on right now. And uh, right now we have our monitor. It is set to 1440p. It is on 100 hertz. So that means you need to find a way to cap your frames to 50 FPS, which I have that on screen. You guys can see that right now, 3090, 50 FPS. Because the way this works on the, the LSFG, you have to have your capped FPS on half your monitor's active refresh rate. So now once that's done, you see how we're pulling uh, 200 watts and, you know, yeah, you can see the, the GPU busy and the frame time, all that kind of stuff. Now we're going to, where we're going to do goo is activate the frame gen. So I'm going to go here. This is the lossless scaling window that you're too, you know, all too familiar with. And now, uh, I, I, I had FSR on. I'm going to turn that off. Actually, I was just trying to see if I see a difference. Uh, here's some of my, some of my settings. I have draw FPS on. This is, uh, one of the people in the comments said uh, to see the FPS that the frame gen is giving you. Turn this on. I didn't know about that until now. I'm going to allow tearing because I don't really care about it and it gives me less latency. And LFFG is on. Hit scale. We're going to tab back into the game. And right now, it should pop up. There it is. So as you can see, um, see if I can, there we go. In the top left-hand corner of the screen, I'm going to zoom in on it. You'll see 120 FPS. So that is the number of frames it's generating. But the game's frame cap is still locked at 50. So those are the frames that it's generating. So it'll feel more responsive uh, because... I guess you're perceiving 120 FPS, even though it doesn't show 120 FPS. I mean, I'm honestly not too sure about the whole frame gen thing, but uh, I got it finally working. At least fully anyway, where I can show it off in a video. Um, and everything I said in the last video is, you know, that's all working fine. Just the frame gen, I had a hard time, like, capturing it. And I even got, uh, as you can notice, um, in the last video, some of the UI was really, like, wiggly and, like, out of, out, of, out of focus and everything. It was, like, wiggling around a lot. That doesn't seem to be the case anymore. I'm moving around the screen. You can see the UI elements on screen. They're kind of, you know, they're, they're all staying where they're supposed to be. Everything feels responsive. There's no, like, delay or anything. So I think I fixed everything. Now, I will quickly go over what I did. Now, this is going to be for an NVIDIA user. So what I did was I went to the NVIDIA control panel. NVIDIA control panel. Program settings. And I found the lossless scaling in your Steam library. You have to find it in your drop down or whatever it is. And I came down here, max frame rate off, vertical sync off. So I added it as a program. That's all I did. And I think that kind of helped, helped us out as well. Um, but I, I've rambled on for long enough. Uh, point is, I got frame gen working correctly. Um, in the video, it was not working correctly, and I apologize about that. But if you guys like this kind of stuff, definitely subscribe for more.